Pearson, the Roadster Tracker here, and we're back with uh, Satisfactory, and I just heard a very unsatisfactory sound just a scooch ago. We um, totally ran out of our power, so yeah. I thought those days were behind us, but it turns out that they're not really. So we're going to have to go see what's the deal with that, but... First of all, let's go visit here. Whoops, other side. Just making sure I got all the stream stuff. Um, we'll go ahead and stick a little bit of this in here and then let's turn everything back on. This should be good enough. Good. Now, let's figure out why this happened. Uh, power needs are something we definitely got to figure out. I cannot uh, stand this, so I think coal... I wanted to keep working with science, but I don't think we can. Okay, you're good. You have plenty of fuel. Go ahead and take this out. Okay. It probably... Yeah. That's not great. We're relying on our um, backup power. Okay, these are the last ones that I plan on ever building of these. So let's see, let's go... One... Two... And I'll go with the third one too. Oh, uh, maybe not. Um, alright, well, let's see here. Do this, good. Okay, so we got two more plants going. That should be good enough, and we've got plenty of fuel for the meanwhile. So, yeah, it'll do for now. Let's go get some more poles. I'm pretty confident we'll have power for the foreseeable future. Probably as long as we're gonna be uh, needing to set up coal. Let's go ahead and grab some more cables. Grab a fair bit of plate. Uh, some rods because we're gonna need a lot of power lines. We'll grab some wire. Wire is gonna be in here. What else do we need? I'm just going to need one coal mine, so let's go ahead and hmm, build one miner here. Let's just see, what does it take to build a coal-fired cave? We'll take a few rotors, I think, and some plates. Those are probably good ideas. Whoops. Oops, we have a container full of these, so let's go ahead and take it. 
Uh, the rotors, I have a feeling we're going to start needing more of those, so I'm going to start um, actually saving those off because we have not really been doing that yet. I say that and we're not even... really taking full advantage of this. Okay. I wish I had the ability to fly. Okay. That should do. Good. Now, where do we got coal? Okay, 600 meters in this direction. <clears throat> Turns out we also need coal for steel, so this is not going to be at all wasted. I'm not going to bother chopping down some trees along the way. Um, it's hard to tell how high it is, but we'll keep going in this direction for the moment. Hmm. I wonder if it's up in those hills. It may be fairly high. Okay, this will be a little bit of an adventure. I think it's pretty common for the coal to be tucked away a little bit. Okay, I forgot to grab concrete. Hopefully we don't need any. Quartz. We'll take it. Unknown crystalline mineral collected. This mineral is composed of the same chemical elements as quartz and may yield similar industrial functions. Research it in the MAM to establish classification and potential application. Let's see what's up here. The quartz, though, is a good find regardless. Uh oh. Yeah, this was probably not the smartest place to come up, unfortunately. Um. Well, it will work. We got a couple of these guys. That's not so bad. Oh, it's four of them. Woo! Uh oh. I need to start making inhalers. No! We'll be fine. <clears throat> Death counter increased by one. Yeah, I should start making inhalers for these kinds of critters. The creatures in this are really just a minor nuance. Luckily for us, though, it's really not going to be a big deal at all to get back here. We're off in this direction. Uh, can I see our route? Not quite. But we're getting pretty close. 
Hmm. Whoops. So we'll have to deal with the critters. They shouldn't be too bad to deal with. A death crate. They actually call it that. I don't remember it being called that before. It's okay. We deserve it, sadly. Okay. Looks like our smart plating is continuing to make good, good progress. We could probably start making the frame so we could get the next uh, level a little bit quicker, but... I mean, I guess we're we're making a progress towards it, so. That's the important bit. Okay. One of these guys is pretty easy to deal with. I say that. Okay, we're done. Good. I don't know why I'm bothering to pick up so many leaves there now. Because I want to clear out the path so I can see what's coming. Constantly jumping around. There we go. Got him. Ooh, these are unusual critters. Three hundred. So really, it needs to go. We need to go in this direction. Hmm. <clears throat> we started veering off a little bit. Ooh, there's a lot of coal here, though. That's good to see. And there's water here too. Okay. What do we got here? What kind of war? Bauxite. So we have a little bit of aluminum for some reason. We'll eventually have to do. I mean, if, as I recall, it's a devilishly complex system. Ketter, any more? Sure, why not? We'll pick it up. Whoa! Where'd you come from? Uh oh. We are literally almost dead. Don't think he likes the water. Okay. Whoops. Let's see here. Does run on water. Got him. Woo! That was a three. I know they go up to seven. Okay, I know we're really, really close. I'm gonna see if 
what we find in this field just while we're here. Is this the coal? Coal, it's a pure mine too. So this would be a very, very good spot to um, set up shop. And I didn't bring the power out here, but that's okay. So we'll have to do a little bit of power kickstart. Um, yeah, this is going to be very straightforward. Just clearing the little path. So I recall you can go upstream. Let's go ahead and chop some of these. Just for clearing the space. Good to get a little bit of wood, but it's mostly leaves anyways. Okay, I think we're basically there. So let's see here, we will need a pump. Pipeline pump mark one, that's not what we need. We need production, water extractor. That may indeed be water. Try submerging your arm. If it does not dissolve, that will narrow down the range of possibilities. Okay. But you could just pipe it to a coal-powered generator and see what happens. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and set up a platform here. Whoops. How did I get off zoop mode? Let's go ahead and start building these generators. Um, how do we want to do that? Well, yeah, let's go ahead and just build generators along here. So let's see here. Coal powered generator. Something like this. Interesting, most pioneers already had coal power set up by this point because they understood their responsibility to humanity. Oof. Pioneer attitude metrics. Reminder, coal powered generators require coal. You think? That should be pretty decent. Um, let's look up the power in the back. Okay, I guess everything's hooked up, so then we'll cook up this over here. We gotta get the water extractors as well. So let's see here. Hmm. The trick is, is how to get the water pipelines. Do I need just copper sheets for those? 
<laughs> let's get the water figured out first. So that's going to be logistics. Okay, we need lots of copper sheets. All right. Well, we'll need some power and some copper sheets. So let's see, which way is the space elevator? It's that way. So we'll just start heading straight this way. We got another coal patch right here. did not mean to do that. Um, we can hook this up there. Let's go ahead and put a ramp down from here. Way too cool of a sound. Whoops, it is. This. Let's go there, maybe? Okay. So this won't quite get me up. I guess I'm content that we took the long way around though. It's ironic that it's actually coming out closest to my other power though. Might not be. These are pre-built maps, so. They may have kind of thought this is what you would do. Well, this will get the coal pumping. Okay. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and insert. Ooh, you're out of wood. Wow. Did not think we're going through this crazy fast. Granted, I added in a couple of new ones, but still. Uh, copper sheets should be made here. Hopefully, we're storing these in a chest. I did not realize just how much we would need this. We're only splitting this in two. Okay. Copper sheets are being made up here. Well could be worse. We're storing them in two different. Okay. That's fine. Let's go ahead and merge these guys up. And then logistics. Let's go... Maybe here? Okay. So we'll start storing these properly now. All right. Hopefully that will be enough. Wow. <clears throat> I did correctly predict the location. Now, unfortunately, our ramp only goes part way.
Yep, this will do quite nicely. Cool. Now we already have most things built, so the fact that I didn't pick up any concrete probably isn't that big of a deal. But we're going to have to do some stuff. Oh, we got a little slug. Over yonder. Um... Let's go with the ramp here. Let's see what's up here. So we got another one of those thingies. There we go. <clears throat> Mercer Sphere. I'll take it. Be interesting to see what all that stuff does when all is said and done. But we can't do anything without the SAM or surface to air missile or. That's further than I would like to fall. Actually, let's kill this one. And then I'm just gonna build a little bit of foundation here. Okay. We're back. <laughs> We're going to get this baby going. So let's see. Let's go ahead and just put the pipe junctions in place. Because I think the pipes are the hard part, if I remember right. It's going to be so nice when we can do this automatically. I'm playing Mark 1. Fixit pipelines can contain any fluid, including the water necessary for coal powered generators. Note water does not flow upwards by itself. While water extractors provide some lift to truly defy gravity, consider the use of pipeline pumps. We're not trying to truly defy gravity. I think that's in the wrong spot, okay. Huh. 
How is that not fitting? Hang on. Should work right there. It says it's a good connection. What the weirdness is it trying to do? Why? I don't know. We'll just... whatever. Okay. Not there. I'm so perplexed. Whatever, we'll just do this one a little bit further out and it's gonna look dumb. Wait, and this seems to go further in. That wasn't the problem, was it? Surely not, no. So what is the freaking problem? Why won't you work? That works, I guess. So I don't know fully how many one of these water extractors can support. We'll get that figured out soon. We'll try just one for the moment. Um... Obviously need another row of these out. Don't care that this looks stupid. Pipe is just intending to go through the floor. Okay. So we're up here now. Let's see here. Let's build as many of these splitters as we can get. this will work as is. Good. May look a little stupid, but it will do. That's the wrong one. We need a sixer here. And that should do. Yep, there we go. 
Choo choo. Now it has no water at all. Why? Is the water not capable of getting up here? Did I build these too high? No, it's it'll get up here. It just takes a little while. Yeah, we've got plenty of water. We see water coming. There it goes. Oh, that's why we have no water here. Well, that's a good reason why. We hear the sound of stuff churning. Woohoo! That is a beautiful, beautiful sound. And you're getting water as well. <clears throat> okay, everything is burning. We'll get water all the way down the line very soon. And this is a very, very easily, easily extendable design. So this is fantastic. Now, one problem with this is we need to split this here I'm gonna take some coal from here that's gonna go elsewhere eventually because we have plenty of spare capacity in this plenty Let's just make sure it still is continuing to provide. Yes, it is. It just took a little while to make up the rest that we were missing. And so soon the capacity is going to shoot up and we'll be well, well above our max consumption line. So we have lots and lots of power available to us now. Good. Now. The next thing we need to do is figure out where the nearest iron is to here. So we need to start making some steel. Back at the base. Ooh, 914 kilometers that way, or meters that way. That's a ways. All right, let's see. Is there any iron in this direction? I guess I could hit the map. So... Not really. All right, we're going to have to do long distance transportation then. If I'm going to do that, I may as well do a full belt. So let's go ahead. Let's build an equipment shop. This is going to be temporary. We're going to get one miner. Dismantled, then we're going to build a minor mark one. Pretty sure it was south, but uh, nope. Okay. Yep, that's built. So it's. What's that? It's north. Okay, so this way. 
Um, take a different one. There's another right there. This is pure. This is pure. Good. See how this looks. Yeah, we'll have full, full satisfaction very soon. Where is it? This is definitely the way we want to go, though. Do I have those lifts? We do have lifts. Let's go figure out how to get over there. Um, okay. Yeah, this won't be too big of a deal. Almost went off the edge there for a second, and that's all right. How is our power situation now? I'm a little disappointed that our gray line is not higher, but I guess it'll get there. Maybe, do we not have enough water? Oh, we have plenty of water. Oh, oh my. Um. Go ahead and upgrade this guy too. So that should get us somewhat of the way here. Let's see how much coal we can burn per second. There's not very much water in here. Okay, we do probably need one more water turbine. Are we using all of the water that's coming here? Flow rate is... Yeah, I think we do need more water. So let's go ahead and put another... Well, first of all... Secondly, let's put you... Nice thing with this particular design is we can just stick these wherever we want, pretty much. And it should all just flow into here. It's going to take a little bit for the pipes to get warmed up. But yeah, we got plenty of water here now. Got plenty of water here. Plenty here. Just nothing here. Oh, 
No power? What? Do we not have you connected on the backside? Did I screw up? Oh, I did screw up. No. It's no power because no water, but we are slowly, slowly getting water there, so it'll happen eventually. It's fine. All right, let's keep going. This is what we're missing. That's the fruit. And that sounds like an achievement. Collectible collected. If consumed before authorized is compatible with the human digestive system by Fixit, the consumer is responsible for any and all consequences. Research it in the MAM to establish classification and potential application. Okay, let's go ahead and connect you to there. This also gives us another way to get onto here, which I like. Good. Yeah, I think those ought to connect. Good. Mm, this I'm probably going to regret. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. We need those parachutes now. Not that parachutes are pretty annoying. No! They're gum. All right, well, let's go rescue our body. The death crate. Oh, it just feels so much shame. Still, I totally get it, game. I totally get it. Man, this is the game that on April Fools, like, Totally, totally changed everything. It kind of freaked me out, actually. <clears throat> it's probably an easier change to do than you would think, but they like changed the lot of the the graphics and all of that kind of stuff. Oops. Okay. There we go. Ah, I'm failing at this miserably. Right, let's go this way. Can't fail that way. Good. If you keep failing, then try to find a way that you're less likely to fail. So how can I get down to this level in a safer way than what we did last time? Okay, that seems fine. Okay, good. <clears throat> That was much, much better. How do I have my weapon? Guess you must keep it. Ah, oh, screw it. Let's just get it done. We'll run in full speed. OK. 
Okay, and we've got a slug here. Just a blue one. And I guess that's it. Well, darn. Blue slug was probably not worth risking our lives over. Especially since we would have gotten it eventually. Okay, let's go ahead and get our conveyor mark two. We're gonna do this to about there. So I need to reverse that actually. Wait, can I reverse? Yeah, just go ahead and do that. I guess I can do this. It will go a little bit more. Eh. It'll do. Alright. Conveyor Mark 2. Uh, let's see. It's mostly north, right? Yeah, we got that. We barely went any of the right direction. Lovely. It's okay. We're still mostly going in the right direction. That sounds really awful. Yeah, we walked past another hatchling. Lovely. Got it. Good. Guess I could have tried to build a truck or something. I could still do that. Um, it is taking coal, so it might actually make sense to do that here. Hmm. Well, tell you what, let's go see where this is. Oh, we got another blue slug. Let's go ahead and pick you up. After we kill this thing. Oh, shoot. Nah! Another one! At least this won't be too bad. Yeah, I'll take a couple of these because I have a feeling we'll need those. The death crate though is vaguely in this direction. Mm, I guess we'll go up. Still a little ways away because it didn't really change direction too much as we gawked. Um, guess we gotta go up. Hmm. Alright, well, that's fine. I was going to say I should have taken power over here, but I really can't, can I? It's fine. Hmm. 
Mm, must be off to the left, so we'll go ahead and do that. Bacon. Boy, I wish I had a rifle. Yeah, I got you. Don't got you. Uh, we'll just build a temporary ramp. Except for I gotta get my death chest. Okay, now we should have plenty of stuff for that temporary ramp. There we go, that's better. Three blue slugs, okay. It still has little lines. All right, where is it? This does look like it would be a very good path to drive on. That'll allow me to upgrade this for a lot cheaper when the day comes. I think steel is one thing you can do. So let's do transport truck station here. We want like this. Fix it reminds you to drive vehicles accurately through a truck station's dock area while recording a path. This ensures it will connect properly once everything is automated. The truck station can be set to load or unload, and can also refuel vehicles. Unlike some pioneers, truck stations care about saving humanity. Truck stations care about saving humanity. Wow. The shade in this game. Oof. Okay, let's conveyor belt this. Can we make it there? Nope, not quite. So let's go to about there. Okay. Good, good, good. So we got fuel. We have no power, which is fine. Um, do we need to build a trailer now? Forget how this works. Tractor picks up and delivers resources. So. We're going to build one of these. Tractors can use any type of fuel and have a self-driving feature, much like Pioneers, only more reliable. While driving, you can record a path to automate vehicle resource transportation. Unlike okay. early self-driving vehicles, tractors will not spy on you. Your employee data is already fully subject to other means of surveillance. Oh. That's good. So this won't load because we can't. But it should be good enough, I think, to get stuff. So how do we... Hang on. Um... E. Okay, so let's go ahead and get you power. I guess we'll just run straight towards the 
Space elevator. Maybe not. Maybe up here? There we go. Probably could have done that more efficiently, but nay. Yep, now we're loading in the coal. So I don't know where this is going exactly. So let's figure that piece out first. Okay, 600 meters. Almost due north. Let's get rid of these guys first. Okay, not bad. Gonna keep going north. Excuse me. Oh, more hatchlings, lovely. All right, let's get rid of these guys. Not fully imminent yet, but it's not looking great. Let's just see what we got here. Lots more hatchlings. Um, all right. And where is our site? That way. Okay. So we're going to leave these power poles as kind of a trail. I'm going to try to stick them on stuff that I'm... Oh, we're missing cables. Alright. <clears throat> Knew that was going to happen sooner or later. How are we doing on time? Let's uh, go back. And I'm going to at least get us to the next site. Because we need to start doing steel processing soon. Pity we're just out of room. But we really kind of are. I haven't looked to see if there's any tiers that we can do without steel, but I have to assume that steel is something we're going to need. It's worth taking a little bit of a scenic route back, seeing what we can see. Don't think there's... We've probably already walked all this stuff, though, to be honest. Yeah, I definitely walked along here before. I almost see my footprints. Okay, we've been in this cave before. Ooh, more spitters. Uh, our health is good enough. Let's go ahead and take him on. That guy was a little bit nasty. That was a four. Wow. What do we got over here? Some sort of a mushroom cave. Don't think I've been in there. Yeah. Mushroom caves are 
fairly rare and they're a very good way to get micella. Okay, we'll take it. Just a little tiny bob, but we'll take it. Let's head back towards the hub. What was it that we were out of cable? Here we go. How's our power look? Look at this! We have tons and tons and tons of power. To the point where I bet you we're barely even using most of this. And eventually this stuff will shut down at least a little bit. Okay. This should be the wire, this should be the cable. Let's go ahead and pick up some concrete because we haven't for a while. And I'm afraid we'll need some. Okay, not surprisingly these guys are out and I'm okay to keep them out. Uh, the ma'am, yes, 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 yes. We haven't seen Sam or... Uh, Caterinium, we don't quite have enough. Well, we might. No. We have to make some fabric. Okay, that's fine. We could get you. Not quite there. The pale berry, due to its tendency to stay light in color even when ripe, is compatible with the human digestive system and has been added to the object scanner. Further research is available. Okay. Got our quartz as well. The crystalline mineral was a previously unknown variation of quartz, with uniquely large and flawless crystals, normally only found in synthetic quartz. The industrial application of this mineral will follow that of its synthetic counterpart, specifically in communication and exploration technologies. But we do have enough to get caterinium mined, so let's go ahead and do this. Okay. Research completed. Caterium ingot recipe unlocked. New Caterium research available. Yeah, we need still for that, which we're working on. We're working on it. Um, let's go ahead and get all of this stuff. The hog protein. Hatcher protein. Spitter protein. Power shards. Alien capsule. Mm. We have a lot of biomass, but that's okay. Tell you what, I think we're going to leave this here for now and we'll figure out the steel next time. Uh, thank you guys so much for joining me. Let me know what questions or comments you guys have. Appreciate everything you do. Until next time, keep on track and take care. We'll see you then. Bye bye.